Hi everyone, welcome back to The Canner Coach. I'm Emily Huber and this week we are going to talk about five common mistakes that we make with diction. So let's get started. The first common diction mistake that is often made is not adding the consonant at the end of the word and singing it all together, especially if you're in a group. So this can happen on words that end with T's or D's or S's. Sometimes if we were to sing the word God, we don't put the D quite on the end of that word. So the first common mistake is to miss those consonants at the end of the word. So make sure we're not missing those. Another common diction mistake is starting words a little bit late on the downbeat. And this happens by starting the consonants a little bit too late. So what I recommend is starting the consonants. Let's work, let's use the word that we used in the last, uh, last little segment, God. If we start that G just a hair before the actual downbeat, it'll help us to sing the word right as we all come in. So that's something to be mindful of because if we're all coming in with the consonants right on the downbeat, it can sound like our entrance is late. So make sure you start that consonant just a hair before the actual starting note and we'll be all set. A third common diction mistake that I have definitely made myself but often try to coach and make sure that we all don't do this is using the instead of the in front of a word that starts with a vowel. So again, using the instead of the with a word that starts with a vowel. I, like I said, I've definitely done this before, but let's use the phrase the earth. We don't want to say the earth as a grammatic rule. So map those out ahead of time, maybe circle them in your music and just know where you have to change the thes to these and that'll help you avoid that diction mistake. The fourth common diction mistake is closing down on our R's too early. So let's go back to that same word that we just talked about. So the earth, if we sing it the earth and we close down too far on that R, it comes out as a very harsh sounding R sound. We really wanna focus primarily on the open vowel that precedes the R and just tap that R at the end of that sustained note. So we don't wanna close down too early, otherwise it can sound like we're maybe morphing the sound a little bit or chewing on it a little bit. So we wanna sing the earth and just kinda of tap that R at the very end. And that'll help you avoid that addiction mistake. And last, but most certainly not least, the fifth most common diction mistake, and guys, I have definitely done this myself, is not singing the right words. Yes, you heard me correctly, not singing the right words. Sometimes we can lose track on the page or we can start daydreaming a little bit or not be focused on what's in front of us. So it's really important to pay attention when we're singing because sometimes we may mess up a word or we may think that a word is something or we might be doing a different version of a song. I know there are so many hymns out there that use the same melody with the different words. So make sure we aren't daydreaming or, or losing our spot on the page and being very, very focused when we sing so that we don't forget the words. Thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Leave me a comment down below and I will look forward to seeing you all next week. God bless you.